Hey, it's Darlene, and I created this layout earlier and realized I didn't even film it, and I felt like it should be shown on my process. So I'm going to talk about it more afterwards. But this paper line by Echo Park called Let's Go Anywhere is so cute. I wish I would have bought more of it. But um, this is the papers that I used for the layout. And there's also these chipboard phrases, which were perfect and they coordinated perfectly. So again, it's a two page spread, very, very simple. I just did two horizontal stripes going across both pages and you'll see that in a minute um, using the red arrow side and then the little mountain side. And then that black and white, just kind of a bunch of different images. I cut those in different sizes. Now I'll have the measurements on my blog which you all have the link down below to my blog. But um, again, very simple. I used a um, information from a postcard that I took. I um, did my own journaling. I added the little deer and just kind of, um, you know, just added some, you know, uh, enamel dots, things like that. Oh, as I'm showing you this, I realized, wow, I forgot to put enamel dots up over there on that right-hand corner. So I'm doing that right now. But um, I have just a variety of um, enamel dots. I did use black and red. I initially was going to use some of that white, but then I changed my mind. But normally, you know, when you think of um, adding embellishments, they always tell you the rule of threes. I have decided to only do two enamel dots in each of those kind of areas, but I think it still looks really cute because I did um, use a variety of sizes. I didn't use like two big ones. I used like a big and a small or a medium, whichever. But another thing that I did, which I loved, is I did the ink, um, black ink around the edges. And that was an afterthought because that white was so stark. And I thought, I'm going to add some ink. So I have those little um, makeup brushes, if that's what you want to call it. I don't know what they're called. The, they have a handle. And I actually bought those from like Amazon or something. And um, the first thing I did was add the splatter. And then I did the ink smudging. So um, a tip for that is instead of going directly to the paper, you kind of put it on the side of the paper and then spread the um, ink onto the paper instead of just directly on the paper. I hope that makes an, some sense. But, um, and then again, I did a black fine point marker and just drew uh, lines around the whole edges. But I hope you like this and I hope this did help. Please leave me a thumbs up if you like this video. Hit that subscribe button down below. I post at least two videos a week. One will always be scrapbooking and the other will be whatever it is I'm creating in the command center, which is my blog and my craft room. Bye.